What is up guys, welcome back to another Rachel Legends video with me, The Real Deal. So, we are going to be busting shards today. And there's some tasty stuff up to grabs. Guaranteed champion going on at the moment. And that is Nekmothar. So this guy is going to be massive for Hydra. Um, in those sort of Lady Kimmy and Michelle team comps, this guy can fill that role. He can do what they do, which is it's all about that speed manipulation. So what does he do? He's going to be increasing our speed. He's going to be uh, buffing our turn meters, boosting our turn meters even, um, which is just massive. Not only does he do that though, he attacks all enemies and has a third. He's going to put out thirty percent decrease speed debuff and leech. So that's going to keep our HP topped up. But it's also going to really slow down the heads, so you get more turns in. You're going to be doing more damage, but also your debuffs are going to stay on them for longer. So say you put out block debuffs, that's going to stop the head of mischief from stealing your buffs. That's going to stop Poison Cloud, be the head of um, cleansing. You're going to get more chances to provoke that as well. So that's going to be massive. It's really going to help people with Hydra. So this guy is going to be a massive game changer. Um, I've not Oh, passive as well. His turn meter is just going to be, he's just going to be flying. He's just going to be going super, super fast. And also increase uh, speed buff aura as well. So it's all about speed with this guy. He's going to be absolutely amazing. So just before we start trying to pull shards, um, how I would build him, um, probably triple perception set. So we want him to have lots of accuracy. You want lots of resistance, lots of HP and lots of speed. And that's pretty much it. And a bit of and a bit of defense as well. So defensive stats and speed and accuracy. That's what you want for this guy. So let's not mess around. Let's just start pulling some shards. So I'm, I'm only going to pull 15. We don't want to go overboard. But like I said, I should definitely be getting someone else. N that champion, never used her in my life. Don't know. Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah, boy. I've wanted this guy for a long time. He is an absolute legend. So what he does is he throws out loads of poisons at the beginning of each turn. And what's so good about this is that he pairs up really nicely with poison explosion champions, but also um, Chagar who's actually something that I've got. So really something I've been like testing out and pair them up together. So amazing, amazing champion. Can't believe I've got him. I've wanted him for, like I said, I wanted him for such a long time. When he came out, I was so disappointed he wasn't part of the fusion. Um, but yeah, he's a great champion. Who's up next? Clod. God. Don't, not, never used him. Don't know too much about him. Apparently he's quite good though. But yeah, never used him. Sinatia, got a ton of these. She is just a chicken to me now. Decent champion though, great for clearing waves. Rear guard sergeant, she is also a great little champion. Um, really good for clan boss with her ally protection. Karam, this guy I think can do. Yeah, he's a poison explosion guy. So I can actually potentially use him with my uh, Cavalax. So nice. Ah, oh, flesh terror. <laughs> Yeah, pretty old school, pretty trash. Come on, give us one more legendary. Um, a cult brawler, um, really good for sort of, I'd say mid to late game for uh, clan boss. Um, does like loads of poisons and stuff. Really good champion for that. Uh, Conehead, yeah, she's pretty decent as well. Um, she's a bit weird though how she her mechanics work, but it's all about sleeps and stuff. But yeah, good little healer she is. Come on, one more. One more gold. Ugh. This guy who looks like he's just been wrecked. Um, yeah, wouldn't bother investing in him. Even like early to mid game, I wouldn't bother. Here we go, come on. Oh, <laughs> it's the guaranteed champion. Oh my God. Do you know as well, like not only does this champion do a lot of good stuff, but he looks so cool. Like, um, I just love his aesthetics um really cool what what is he he is iguana he's an iguana but um yeah i love i don't know if this is like a shield or it's just like a you know um if you join like a frat party it's one of those spanking paddles and he looks like he spanks two people at a time but um yeah really cool looking champion can't wait i'm straight up i'm gonna be leveling them out straight away and see what we can do with him. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I wish you all the best of luck with your pulls. I will hope you pull some big, fat, juicy, game-changing champions that's really going to help boost your account. 
And if you've enjoyed today's video, please leave me a cheeky thumbs up. Make sure you smash, smash, smash that uh, subscribe into the ground. And I will see you in my next video. Peace.